Don't worry. You're not alone on this. I am here to help you figure it out. Let's dig a little deeper. Your typical glitches are triggered by sensory stimulation, similar to how most people experience memories when exposed to particular sights, sounds, or smells. But this wasn't the case with the other glitches that you experienced recently. No, they triggered randomly. That's what I suspected. And now tell me, what did they seem like to you when you experienced them? Corrupted visions of my past. I think we're on to something. Your usual glitches were making you recall memories. No more harmful than remembering your wedding day when hearing Mendelssohn's march. We have to differentiate them from those severe malfunctions that you experienced in the slaughterhouse and at the mall. Those latter ones are the real problem, and we need to get to the bottom of it. But I think I've gathered quite a lot of valuable data, and at our next session, I'll present my conclusions. Hey, Robo, could you stop by the cells on your way to read? Someone there wants to speak to you. I don't know. If it happens, I'm definitely getting sacked. I've got a degree in robotics, not in human relations. Sometimes I'm surprised you go to high school. I'd recognize those footsteps anywhere. Over here, Tin Man! What did you do this time? Well, your buddies found me with some nuke that I bought with that money that you let me keep, remember? It turns out that the legal amount that you can carry is zero. Can you believe that? Only an addict would not believe that. That's true. But none of this matters. I'm here mainly to congratulate us. We did it. We got the guy. We... We sure did, partner. Any new leads? Are you looking for trouble? This is the they lived happily ever after part of the story. Wendell was conducting suspicious activities for someone at OCP. I want to know who. Shit. I thought you were just looking to avenge your partner. I forgot that you're a dutiful officer. All right. I'll keep my ear to the ground and see what the streets are saying. Good. Talk to you later, partner. Seriously? I didn't think he had one. Need a hand, rookie? Actually, I do. Still not used to working with one hand. You'll eventually Murphy, forget about my being office. shot the first time. <laughs> yeah? When? When you get shot the second time. Why Catching Antonowski put a smile on a lot of people's faces. But we still have one unresolved issue. Catching his accomplice at OCP. Exactly. And when everyone realizes that OCP's been sabotaging us the whole time, mentions of a strike will come up again. We don't want that. So who do you think it is? Becker is an obvious choice. I just don't know if that's not too obvious. Do you suspect that Becker is on Windows payroll? No, I don't. <laughs> I guess he is, because <laughs> I'm not given another option. All signs point to him. Sure, at least. They do, don't they? And that leads me to another thing. Becker wanted to meet you. You're supposed to show up at some old factory. And he wanted you to come alone. A rather unusual request. That's why I'll get Officer Washington to listen in. 
By the way, how do you feel about it? Can you trust him? He is an OCP employee first, police officer second. I know what you mean. Maybe having him listen in on your meeting with Becker will give us some definite answers to what his priorities are. I'm skeptical of anyone that OCP tries to push on us. First Becker, then Washington. And let's not forget about Dr. Blanche. Speaking of which, Dr. Blanche, is she, is she being helpful? Are you getting anything out of those sessions? This process takes time. Like most things that are worthwhile. I will meet Becker, but there is a place I will visit first. Sure thing. In the meantime, I'll brief your overseer. Officer Washington! Yes, sir. You've got a new assignment. I'm ready and willing. Did you watch the game yesterday? I don't know what's wrong with our team. What losers. I want to throw the TV out the window, but it was too heavy. I pulled a hamstring because of that. Wait, why are you asking me about my liver and kidneys? They shot me in the leg. We can offer you a higher. She's standard. waiting for you, Murphy. If you decide to sell. Just get the bullet out and let me leave. Come on, give me the skinny. I want to know everything. Ah, Murphy, we started the party a little early. I hope you don't mind. Sorry, partner. It's my fault. I just got to hear what's happening at the precinct. In usual fashion, OCP's doing everything in its power to keep the police down. Come on, this is time to celebrate. Lewis is feeling better, Wendell's in jail. Let's party. If you don't think a strike is brewing... You know what? Let me get this grouch out of here so that you two can talk. Okay, okay, I'm going. Feel better, Lewis. You look well. I gotta admit, I sleep better knowing that you got that bastard. But what about you? How have you been lately? Did you get any more of those visions? I still see things. You know, ever since Antonowski showed up, they seem to be happening more often. And with greater intensity. I don't think I've ever seen you in such a state. I just know how it affects me. So I can't imagine how it affects you. The fact that he's the brother of one of those guys who... shot you. We should not let the past haunt us. Easier said than done. 
His presence reminds me of the day that I... that I left you. I often think that maybe if we didn't split up that day, things would have gone down differently. Neither of us could have predicted the consequence of our actions. That doesn't make me feel any less guilty. What I don't get is if Wendell is actually the brother of one of your murderers, then why did he come out now? After all this time? And why didn't he kill you when he got a chance? That is what I intend to find out. Right. Is it true that he's working with someone from OCP? That is what he claims. Damn, Becker. We should just lock him up already. We do not have proof. Not yet. I don't know if you heard, but the old man ended up in this hospital after his heart attack. I'm not even sure if he's in a state to talk, but it probably wouldn't hurt to check if he knows anything, right? Anyway, I think I need a little rest after all this excitement. Thank you for visiting me. We'll be back to working together in no time. I look forward to it. Good. I don't think I can last a minute longer in this stench. Get away. Hey, where do you think you're going? To talk to the old man. You're the only one who actually showed up to pay him a visit. You know he talks about you a lot. Does he? Yeah, Seven about eight. you being granted human rights. He's rooting for you. Well, maybe already. it's not such a bad idea. You can go in. Do they not have the rights to use his name or something? Why does, why does everyone call him old man? I serve this town with every drop of my sweat. I always try to improve people's lives. I always good to them. Just this like is a Viet Cong with this tiny ass TV. We did not see like a mile away from the city it. rise. Can he even like look down enough to Don't see it? Don't you worry. This is treatment. I promise it will happen. Mother. Why aren't you saying anything? It's like a 20 inch or something. <laughs> they think it makes CRTs bigger than that. You should get a rear projection or something in here. Maybe, you know, just a projector. Just roll down a uh, white projector screen to project onto. Michael, is that you? Your halo shines so bright. That was Michael. Someone in OCP was supporting Wendell's operations. I want to know who. Robocop? Oh God, I'm getting close to my final days. I just can't stand this uncertainty. But you came back from the other side. Tell me. What other side? How was it? How? Was it unbearable? Oh, I got shot. The pain was, is crushing. But every officer is aware of the risk. That is not what I wanted to hear. I believe that death isn't the end. You are walking proof of that. Unfortunately, I have not completed all I set out to do. All saboteurs inside OCP won't let me. Are you referring to Max Becker? That weasel seeks not only to destroy you, but also my company. Be wary of him. I know you would never let anyone jeopardize the good name of OCP. Before you go, could
Could you be so kind and give me some painkillers? Get your uh, employees to be subordinate if you want to. That's better. I can always count on you. Can't I? Thank you, son. The helicopter is on its way, sir. Perfect. Oh, good news. I don't know if that was exactly Leave now. We need to get him ready for the transfer. I mean, he thinks... He didn't sound like he was speculating. So, I guess it is... Becker. Why the long face, Robo? They'll pump him full of OCP's cocktails and come Monday morning he'll be back to signing deals if nothing happened. I won't allow you to treat me like this. I am the mayor of this city. Robocop, you have to intervene. Is there a problem? This man is preventing me from exposing OCP's hypocrisy. The way this hospital treats its patients is the best depiction of what OCP wants to do with this city. A brave policewoman shot in the line of duty is crammed into a small room while the old man has a cozy VIP wing of the hospital all to himself. This is what Delta City stands for. Even bigger division. But the time you had your tonsils removed, you were staying in the VIP wing too. We're not talking about me. We need to talk about the people. Robocop, please stop this madness. Make a statement. That policewoman is your partner, isn't she? So tell us, doesn't she deserve better? Lewis should be treated under better conditions. Hey, cameraman, you got that? Even an OCP robot sees the hypocrisy. Listen to him. Don't let OCP take away our city. Say no to Delta City. Vote for the neighborhoods. Vote for Kuzak. Okay, guys, we're leaving. We should find him a cozy, secluded, preferably padded room. Seek answers. You came, so you can follow a command. Surprising. Surrender, or there will be trouble. Defiant as usual. Your creator screwed up the job by not installing an off switch. Well, it doesn't pay to fix their mistakes. It's cheaper just to replace you. So, Robocop. Meet the future of law enforcement. Well, and I mean, at least it's an improvement from head to an eye. <laughs> Power like, like yours, stairs, but at the push of a button. That is why it is not only more effective than you, but infinitely more obedient. That's just a fragment of the speech I had prepared. But hell, this product speaks for itself. There's no appreciation, buddy. Gunshots? What's going on? Becker has introduced the new to his new robots. UEDs? <laughs> Mr. Becker bragged about them during my onboarding. I'll try to find something that could help. Just give me a sec. Investigation of justice. Resisting arrest. Drop the weapon. Abide my jurisdiction. 
Destruction. Restoring order. Discontinue the fight. Let us see if they ever got around to fixing it. Warm up is over. Get ready for the real strike. I knew the guy that made you. Bob Morton, right? An arrogant brown nose. I used to be happy that he was dead. One less asshole on my way to the chair. Now, I Drop your weapon. You can see your end. and wanted to shut it down. He was certain that your brain was what was making you superior to them, so Becker continued to work on the project in secret. He took a big gamble. Hey, who are you talking to? Uh, so... Is that Oedipus guy helping you? <laughs> Once I'm done with you, his career is over. You are durable, I'll give you that. You could become a strong part of my urban enforcement unit. But you're redundant to our Oh! 